And welcome back to Varsity Sports Now. Well, each and every week this season, we are spotlighting one of the top players in either North or South Dakota. We've already done Justin Decker from here on. And this week's spotlight star comes from Bismarck. And for more on him, here's Katie Lingle. Thanks, guys. Our one-on-one -on -one this week features a senior out of Bismarck St. Mary's who's a pretty incredible athlete. Here's more on Ben Weisbeck. Ben Weisbeck's love of the game began at a young age. Oh, first time, it was probably when I was three years old. My grandma for Christmas, she got me a Little Tex basketball hoop and then a Michael Jordan jersey. And so I remember I'd just uh, be wearing that thing every single day. Um, I'd be downstairs just shooting that hoop. I'd be watching the NBA playoffs and pretend like I was Kobe Bryant or Michael Jordan. And uh, I mean, that's when I first started to really fall in love with the game. As Weisbeck watched and imitated his idols play on the biggest stages, he knew he wanted basketball a part of his future, too. I mean, as it kind of progressed, uh, and as I pretend to be those players, I realized that, I mean, I had a dream of, you know, going to play professional basketball, going to play college basketball, and that's where all the, the dream all started. Aside from being a gym rat, racking up hours working on his game, he has a natural athletic ability that makes his combination of hard work and talent lethal on the court. He's gifted with, with great power, great strength, great quickness. Um, you know, and he's able to use all three of those while he competes. Um, you know, he's great around the basket, can finish, he's athletic, explosive, um, does a good job shooting the basketball. You know, he can shoot out to 20 feet and uh, he's worked really hard on all aspects of his game. He uses this athleticism to excite fans as well as his future coach with some pretty incredible throwdowns. Everybody watches him jump, you know, and obviously he's got phenomenal runs. He has them in warm-ups. Um, and, and, you know, all summer he had these real bright shoes. So, you know, they even looked like they were two feet higher than they probably were. Uh, it was a great way of bringing attention to yourself. And it looks like he was six feet up in the air when he was doing those things. It's un unlike anything else. Um, I remember my freshman year was the first time I ever dunked, and that feeling was unlike anything else. It's like, I mean, as a kid, I think it's every single kid's dream to be able to go up and just slam on home. And uh, my freshman year, when I first ever got down, that was the greatest move. I remember calling my brothers and saying, I can dunk, I can dunk. Uh, so it, the feeling is unlike anything else. However, Weisbeck knows an even greater feeling would be to win a state championship. After a consolation championship last year, Weisbeck and nine other seniors returned from last year's team and are poised to win it all this year. The expectations are pretty high. So, uh, I mean, as I was, coaching, I was talking to Coach DeCook before the season, I mean, it's kind of a, a winter bust season. Uh, definitely state championships are our goal. Um, I mean, kind of winning everything, going undefeated. I mean, all those things are nice, but I mean, winning state championships is definitely a goal for the team this year, nothing but. Well, win or bust this season, Weisbeck plans to continue his career at Augustana College. Coach Billiter believes he's got a chance to make an impact right away. You know, physically, he's in a better situation than most kids, but I can't only wait to see. We have a phenomenal strength coach in, in Brett Chambers. I can't wait till Coach Chambers gets a hold of him for a few months, too, because the young man's going to really, uh, I think, just really blossom and, and keep developing and becoming a good player. All right, thanks, Katie. Let's take a look at some of the numbers that Ben Weisbeck brings to the table. Jason, as a junior, averaged uh, 18 and a half points a game, five rebounds, over two assists. He was the only junior on the Class A All-State team, so it's not like this is some secret. This kid's been known about for quite some time. You know, even as a sophomore, he actually averaged more points per game as a sophomore. Always been an offensive threat. Last year really took his game to another level because of his rebounding. He got everybody else involved. He got the team involved all the way to a fifth place finish. They did win their region in the regional tournament, so uh, this team has really taken strides towards their ultimate goal of winning the championship. All right, uh, certainly going to be a good player to get for Augustana. I know they're excited to have Oh, they're very excited. I mean, Weisbeck's numbers jump off the page, obviously. You saw the dunks in the piece. He's a very great athlete, and that's what they're looking forward to as a defender at the NCAA level. To be able to have that kind of athleticism, he will be able to shut some people down. So Tom Billiter, very excited to have him be a Viking next year. All right. Well, there were plenty of great plays over our holiday break, but only a select few were good enough to earn Jandy's coveted stamp of approval. Find out if this one made the cut right after this. Varsity Sports Now, presented by Shields.